Now, go. How does it feel to be owned, America? How does it feel to be owned, land of the not so free and certainly home of the not so brave, if you think that someone, anyone, would need an assault rifle to protect their 10-year-old computer and power tools <laughs> or credit cards which could more easily be hacked? Well, you might need it say, to murder a classroom full of unarmed children, or disabled people in a social center, lovers on a dance floor, teenagers on dates watching a movie, friends who save for two years to go to a country music concert in Vegas, old ladies with their grandchildren's in church, oh, and that church in Texas too, did we forget that one? Well, maybe, yeah. Maybe, yeah, you'd need it to take out that gang of rustlers who are trying to steal your herd, or those FBI agents here to break up the child sex ring in your compound, or protect your backwoods marijuana farm, or your suburban meth lab from some tipped-off young policemen or rivals, or to make sure that some other drug-dealing gang doesn't steal your turf, or to resist the government if you don't like the next president. Who is the NRA arming anyway? Or to walk into Walmart and make the shelf stockers and cashiers nervous, or to have a bit of fun shooting empty beer bottles off a fence, imagining 18-year-olds begging for protection, or hoodie-wearing teenagers, or an Afghani terrorist who, by the way, supplies the poppies for your opioid habit but doesn't own a plane, or just to feel a tiny spurt or dribble of phallic pride. Tough guys, pathetic losers, overcompensating morons. How does it feel to be owned? Home of the about as brave as a president who laughs when he recalls the risks he took not serving in Vietnam, but sleeping with multiple women and dodging the VD, that's venereal disease, not Veterans Day bullet, and was so happy when he was given a purple heart by a fan and he didn't even have to save a life or risk his. Ooh, I always wanted one of those. Did you forget that? Home of the owned, home of the owned, home of the owned by NRA, arms manufacturers, drug cartels, weapon dealers, who got you to vote for the politicians in your pockets by making you ooh so scared or ooh so mad, all because they weren't making enough money just arming child soldiers around the world. Their women are dripping in diamonds bought with your anger. Painted fingers weighed down with blood red ruby rings. Their children are swimming in silvery water, bought with the tears and screams of other mothers' babies. They are rolling in pigs in the blood of all of us who now fear and hate each other enough to want to kill each other. They have pitted us all against each other, and our souls are burning to ashes with ballistic rage. But hey, cha-ching, cha-ching. Next time you look at your own wife's naked, work-weary hands, cha-ching, cha-ching. How does it feel to be owned, America? Forever in peace, may you be saved. What? Yeah.